In this video, I'm going to talk about the co-authoring and commenting functionality within the Microsoft Power Pages Design Studio. So as you can see on the screen, uh, I'm in make.powerpages.microsoft.com. So this is a Power Pages Design Studio and I've opened one of the site which I have created. So that's Portfolio 2024. And I can see the main navigation because I'm in the pages section of the Design Studio. Now, as you hover your mouse over here, you will be able to see something called as comment. Now, what does that mean? Is like, uh, if you are authoring this website, you can comment across various uh, pages or elements or components within your Power Pages Design Studio. So take for example, if you have a team, so uh, my team member comprises of say myself, Girish, Alex and Adele. So we three are working in one of the projects uh, for Portfolio 2024 for one of the organization. Now, if we are authoring this page, then we can communicate in between uh, uh, the team members so that we know exactly that uh, we are preparing all the website web pages as per the specification of the customer deal. Okay. So take, for example, if I uh, say create a new page and if I create a page called as say products, okay. And if I add this page uh, in the site, and now if I'm not sure about whether or should I call it as products or portfolio, then maybe I can put a comment around it and I can say, hey, Alex, so I'm just putting at the rate, okay? The more you put in at the rate, you can reference a person. And I can say, hey, Alex, is the uh, products page name as per spec by control so i see okay so if this is my question then what happens is like the moment you click on the send button it says alex wilbur will be notified by email about your comment okay so i'll just click on say post comment the moment i do that you can see over here there is one comment listed over here now from here itself you can also go in and create a new comment so if i create a new comment if i want to create an another comment and this one is for adele so maybe hey adele can you please start authoring this page and show me first draft by uh, third 2024. Okay, so I've posted a comment for Alex, posted a comment for Adele. Now, what will happen is like if I navigate to Alex, so if this is Alex's profile in under in email and the Outlook, you will see that I have mentioned Alex's name. Hey, Alex is the products page name as per spec by Contoso. So maybe what Alex can do is Alex will click on this button, go to comment. Now, the moment Alex does that, Alex will be landing in make.powerpages.microsoft.com and uh, Alex will be uh, navigated to the design studio and Alex can read uh, the further comments and Alex can also see what's happening within the Power Pages design studio, how the development is progressing and who all are collaborating in this particular page. Now, if you see over here, you can see a person, it says Girish, so that means Girish is in currently uh, working on this page. And also Alex can see the comment which was posted by Girish over here. Also, Girish can see, uh, Alex can see what Girish has posted for Adele as well uh, in this particular uh, section. So maybe Alex can say, okay, uh, hey Girish, uh, the page name must be portfolio instead of products okay and alex has now commented and now uh, technically girish should get those notifications if girish is uh, logged into the application now girish is already logged into the application and uh, now the reply is not instantaneous over here because this page does not get uh, refreshed automatically so if you again navigate back you know uh, you can you cannot uh, see the comment which was posted by Alex, but you can see the presence from here, Alex, Alex Wilbur. So you can see that Alex is currently in this uh, page as well. Okay. Now let me refresh this page. So I'll just reload this page just to see what uh, my team member has posted the comments. Now 
this is the feature which I would be requesting from Microsoft that instead of refreshing the design studio just to see the uh, live comments uh, I would want you know like the comment to be uh, appearing instantaneously rather than me refreshing the page again and again okay so if I click on comment over here I can see that Alex has posted this and maybe based on this I will say okay all good maybe I'll go and make this change and I'll make the change I'll rename this page and I can say that thanks Alex closing the thread okay so so what I'm doing is like I'm just posting the comment and at the same time I will say I will now resolve the thread okay so I can resolve the thread I can delete the thread I can edit the comment now I, I just want to resolve the thread so I'll just see what happens when I click on resolve the thread the moment I do that this is marked as resolved okay similarly for Adele if I have posted this message maybe I can edit the comment and say uh, also let me know the effort for development so what I've done is that I've posted a comment to Adele and then I've edited this comment so I can do that and I've sent that to Adele and similarly Adele uh, once Adele opens this page Adele will receive two comments one was uh, earlier which was a can you please start authoring this page and show me the first draft by 3rd Jan 2024 and the one after that which I have just submitted to Adele which will come in a while now what I can do if Adele, see, Adele sees this comment Adele can go into this comment and then Adele can start uh, again uh, collaborating now in the presence indicator uh, let me show you the presence indicator over here I can see that there is Alex over here now once Adele signs in so as I see that Adele has also signed in so let this page load so now there are three users Girish, Adele and uh, Alex uh, all three of them are collaborating and they have already commented and they have communicated with each other um, about the pages page development um, and now here Adele can see the latest comment and now Adele can say uh, say 10 hours and I will be doing this by today okay so maybe Adele has commented this now from here if you see in this page you have Gerish and you have Alex as well so that means it, it shows you that uh, it's a co-authoring functionality whereby uh, who all are uh, using which pages for development uh, at the current stage so I can see that for portfolio uh, as Adele uh, Gerish and uh, Alex are also on this page and they are they might be doing some changes okay and that's how you you know uh, build those uh, uh, capabilities within your team of uh, co-sharing uh, the development work now from here itself you can if you click on Girish here you can send an email or maybe you can start a teams chat okay so if you don't want to communicate just by using the comment functionality you can use a uh, teams chat or start an email so if I click on send an email then what happens it's uh, it will uh, basically uh, open uh, and uh, email uh, window like an outlook window which is already opened in my other machine uh, and if you open this in a teams then it will open the teams chat so then it will again trigger uh, teams uh, application uh, in a new tab and then it will ask you whether you want to open it in your web app or uh, or actual uh, teams uh, web application So now again this will again log into teams and then you can further communicate within teams so so that's that's all about you know co-authoring functionality and commenting within microsoft power pages design studio so there are multiple ways to navigate one is from here you can do a comment new comment for a specific page also you can navigate from this section whereby you can see all the pages uh, comments in one central location so example if i go into say about us page and if i add a comment then i can see uh, this is a performance from about us page okay and I've just commented it I haven't uh, marked anyone but uh, if you see here you will see a uh, message icon uh, 
So that indicates that there is a comment for that specific page. So uh, this section will only render comments from a specific page. Okay. So if, if I click on portfolio page, then it will show you all the comments related to portfolio. So that means it is under the context of a page. Okay. So every page has a different comment context. So if I go to blog, I can't see anything because no one has posted anything on the blog. But if I put something over here, um, then I can um, see that even the blog has specific comments over here. This shows you the presence indicator who all are present in specific pages. So if I'm in blog uh, and now, so I'm as Adele, I'm in blog. Now, if I go to Girish, I can see that Adele isn't working on blog. Maybe Alex moves to V2 page, okay, and Alex is currently working on say V2 page. Then I'll be able to uh, see uh, over a period of time. Yes, Alex is on V2 page, Adele is on blog page, and myself is working on portfolio page. So that's how you do all those co-authoring functionality uh, within Power Pages Design Studio. So that's it, folks. This is all about uh, co-authoring functionality and commenting within Power Pages Design Studio. Thanks for watching.